Hi, I'm Steve Warner, Exploration Manager for Australian Resources. You can see behind me we're loading the 5A MET sample. That, uh, this MET sample is going up to Glencore's Murrah Murrin operation. We've got about 2,500 tonnes of crushed mineralisation on the pad and we're going to put that through the HPAL process. The, uh, the MET sample mining that we've done in the bottom of the 5A pit required us to drill and blast, dig a trench through the, uh, the high grade mineralisation, crush it down to 10 millimetres and then, then stick it on the ROM pad behind us. What we've learned uh, in that process is significantly de-risking the, the rest of the 5A operation where we're targeting probably about another 16,000 tonnes of very high grade mineralisation, over 7.5% 7, 7 nickel. Uh, that mass of sulphide is going to fragment very well, it's very visual, we should be able to dig it out, crush it down and uh, with a high grade like that survive the trucking cost. The last part of the process is for us to deliver this to Glencore's Murrah Murrah operation where they'll put it through the HPAL process. So this has been a significant milestone for us to get this, uh, this mineralisation on the pad and heading over to Murren. It's been probably 12 months, very long 12 month in-depth process for us to get to this point. Drill, blasting, crushing, trucking, all of the, uh, all of the approvals that we've needed. So we're really looking forward to uh, getting this on the ROM pad. So we've, uh, we've crushed our metallurgical sample to 10 mils using a, a large transportable cone crusher. And this is it. This is actually one of the highest grade piles. When we crush these, we find that they break up really fine. And a lot of our waste rock stays quite coarse. So I'm just gonna do some beneficiation studies just to see if we can upgrade some of the soil. Uh, really, all of this will be the MET sample, but this is just extra sampling that we're doing after. The nickel minerals here, because of the, uh, the mass of sulphide, they've, uh, they've rusted themselves down and they're a lot more friable. So if I take a handful here, you can see that some of this, most of this very coarse stuff is actually basalt and the very fine stuff, which has got a lot of clay in it, is, uh, is our ultramafic and our massive sulphides have um, got violarite in them and what happens is they break down uh, in the cone crusher to a much finer fraction than all of the coarse basalt stuff. So if we get all this coarse basalt and we throw it away, we're left with a lot more nickel.